So I'm a medical registrar in geriatric medicine. One of the reasons why Admiral's Hospital and I worked there for two and a half years, one of the reasons why I was in so much problem was because of debt, because of over-reliance on locums. Now, the new uh, junior doctor contract, which is being forced upon doctors, it will increase locum spending because junior doctors will leave. Now, what this will mean is patient safety will be greatly compromised. There will be fewer doctors for you to see. You'll have to wait longer for you to see them, and they'll be burnt out. Now, when this will target the female doctors who want to have children, researchers who are researching things like cancer, dementia, heart disease. All right, I get the point. Can I just make one final point, please? What you're saying is the change to the contract for junior doctors is going to lead to... If I could just make one final point. When bankers were allowed to keep their bonuses, it was because we could not possibly not allow them to leave the country because they were such an asset. Are the staff members of the National Health Service not an asset? We, uh, it, this is the style of the dismantlement of the National Health Service. And as junior doctors, we will strike to prevent this from right. happening. We cannot let yes, this happen. We, we will not.